That's a good, that's like a jazz rock. <laughs> jazz songs. See, it's the jazz toads. They're, you know, they're so, you know, making their way into your everyday vernacular. They are. All right, are we on? Okay, this is week three, five weeks at East Coast Swing in Charleston. We learned a lot tonight. We worked on our pinwheel and East Coast Swing. We learned to take our triple step out of our East Coast Swing into a full step jitterbug. And then we took everything that we've learned thus far and put it into jitterbug motion. And then we also learned our classic dip. So this is Katie, she is my lovely assistant for the evening. We're gonna start um, just in open position. Um, and actually, let's face the, the camera one more time. Mm -hmm. um, as we are going to do the difference between the uh, triple step and full step, okay? I lead with my left, you read, lead, lead with your right, and I'm gonna go trip, full step, trip, full step, rock, step. This is classic East Coast swing. Dance to moderate to slow tempo jazz. Otherwise, if it's bluesy jazz or it's fast jazz, we can use our whole step. We eliminate the triple step, um, and it's just a change of weight, and we're gonna go step, step, a rock, step, 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 a rock, step, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. And we can dance to faster jazz without our triple step. Okay, now we're gonna connect, and we're gonna work on our pinwheel. We're gonna, I'm gonna do it in triple step, and then I'm gonna do it in our full step. And I'm gonna go trip, full step, trip, full step, a rock, step, into my figure eight. A rock, step, and then I'm gonna pull with my right hand. She steps with her right, I step with my left. It's a 180 degree pivot. We're gonna tap each other's back, push, pull, push, pull, push, pull, push, and then as I get to this point right here, and I'm about to give her a pull, I'm going to start my triple step again, and I'm going to bring my right hand up and in front of her face for an inside turn. One and two, three and four, five, six. Okay? Now I'm going to do that same move, but I'm going to use our pull step jitterbug footwork instead. I'm going to go step, step, a rock, step, 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 a rock step, step, step. And now, and just step around the dance floor. Again, I'm going to get to this position. And now, with my left leg, I'm gonna start my count on one again. And I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, four. Okay, I'll do it a little bit faster. Why end the song the normal way when you can end it with a dip? <laughs> okay? So our five part dip, okay? Inside turn, waist, neck, lunge, dip. Starting on inside turn, I'm gonna take my left hand, give her an inside turn as she comes around, I'm gonna grab her waist, physically place her hand behind my neck. I'm gonna lunge to the left, dip, and then come out of the lunge. Okay, I'll do it from a different angle. And here we go, inside turn, grabbing the waist as she comes around, physically placing her hand behind my neck, lunging, dip. And that is your week three tutorial. Come again next week. <laughs> <laughs>